τελειώσει και την απόδοσή σου, έχει αποφασίσει να κάνει κάτι στη ζωή σου το οποίο περιέχει, περιέχει πολύ ρίσκο. Πώ το αποφάσει αυτό. Um, I didn't really choose it, it chose me, you know, I, I've been doing stunts for a long time for film and TV and I was just, I was working on a movie and some, some guys were doing these crazy jumps on the rooftops and I was like, what is this stuff? I want to try it too. So I just kind of started watching videos and started training with the guys and, and I fell in love with it right away and I've been doing it every day since. Είναι πολύ περίεργο για μα γιατί πραγματικά εγώ προσωπικά έρχομαι πρώτη φορά σε επαφή και επικοινωνία με μια γυναίκα η οποία είναι κασκαντέρ. Αυτό πώ προέκυψε στη ζωή σου. I decided to do stunts because after college I, I didn't know what I wanted to do for a living. Um, and I did gymnastics and soccer in college and so one of my friends was moving out to LA to do stunts and acting and so she invited me to come and I was like, yeah, sure, why not? So just kind of I just moved to LA and just tried to figure out how to how to get work and it takes a long time to break into stunts. I mean, you have to be really dedicated. I mean, it took four or five years before I really started working. So it just takes a lot of time and dedication and you just have to stick with it, you know. Πώς είναι να συναντάς όλους αυτούς τους αστέρες του Hollywood; Είναι κάτι το οποίο για μας είναι πάρα πολύ ξένο. You know, it, when I first started doing stunts, I was like really excited to meet all the the famous actors and stuff like this, but you know, now that I've been doing it for a long time, it's not You know, you don't get it as excited anymore, you know, but it's still really cool. It's really fun to be able to work on, you know, really big projects and just meet all the cool people that, you know, we get to meet. It's really fun. Έχεις συμμετάσχει σε πάρα πολλές ταινίες στο Hollywood. Πες μας μερικές από αυτές. I worked on, uh, I worked on Zombieland, Indiana Jones, Transformers. Um, there's a new movie coming out called Spy that I worked on, The Conjuring, Identity Thief, and I've, I've worked on a lot. I always forget which one I worked on. Πες μας μια ιστορία από τα χειρίσματα μιας ταινίας. Τι σου συνέβη; It was when was it? It was two years ago. I was working on a movie called Identity Thief. Uh, I was doubling Melissa McCarthy, and um, I had to get hit by a car. And so I was wearing a I was wearing a body suit um, for padding, and so the car hit me, and I did it once, and it was all good. And then I had to do it again, and I I hit my head and cracked my face open, so I had to go to the hospital. But that's the only time I've been to the hospital so far. So. Hopefully we can stay safe, you know. But stunts is it's a calculated risk, you know what I mean? Like we're not like there are people that are very, very professional that are very good at what they do. So we rehearse a lot and we're really prepared. So we make them as safe as possible. My my favorite actor that I've worked with is Clint Eastwood. He was amazing. Such a really fun and cool guy. Like he was like climbing up on the rooftops, like getting all the shots and just making fun of people. Like he was it was amazing to work with him. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I was really afraid of the car hit. I was afraid of afraid of stair falls. Like I got to hang from a helicopter a couple months ago in Budapest for a movie, and that, I was really afraid at first. But everybody there is really, really professional, and so they just made me feel really comfortable, really safe. So that was actually I was really afraid at first, but then it ended up being the funnest stunt I've ever gotten to do. Θα μπορούσες να φανταστείς τη ζωή σου χωρίς ρίσκο; I I can't imagine my life like not taking risks. I mean, my my mom rides uh, horses professionally. She does barrel racing. So my mom is crazy. My dad was a tennis pro for a long time. So it's kind of in the family. My brother's a stuntman. So, you know, it kind of runs in the family. So I think overcoming fear is an incredible feeling. And so, you know, knowing in your mind and your heart you can do something and actually going out there and, 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 and accomplishing it and overcoming that fear, it's a really empower, empowering feeling. Ε, φαντάζομαι ότι στη Σαντορίνη έχει επισκεφθεί και πάλι, το ξέρουμε και από τι προηγούμενε χρονιέ. Πώ σου φαίνεται καταρχά η Ελλάδα και γνωρίζω ότι ξέρει και δύο-τρει λέξει ελληνικά. Um, yeah, this is my third time in Santorini. The first time I was just here for vacation with my family. And then in 2012 I got to come and compete in the Art of Motion. And it's, it's such an amazing thing to be back here. Like it really is paradise for free runners and, and I love it here. And the, I, I know two Greek words. I know ευχαριστώ uh, and παρακαλώ. Εμείς ευχαριστούμε πάρα πολύ για το χρόνο που διέθεσες και θα θέλαμε να μας δείξεις και αυτό το το βραβείο που πήρες πριν από λίγα λεπτά. No, thank you for having me, and this is my first. That's female. And hopefully someday we can have a, a female competition for our own. You know. So I just my goal is to keep inspiring women and hopefully getting more involved. And someday we can we can have our own competition. You know. So. <laughs> Wait, just, just, just. My girl's finger here.